if you're new to my channel hey and thank you to all the people who always watch my videos come on now we got to get subscribers up i just want you guys to interact with me i just want to take a moment for my eyeliner real quick like can we take a moment of silence for my eyeliner like real quick let's just take a moment of silence do y'all see this do y'all see this bomb eyeliner i was about to quit my video for this hey I'm trying my best <laughs> to do what I can and fix this, but it's just not working out for me. And I'm about to start getting angry. My eyeliner was just giving me the hardest time of my life. And I don't know why. I don't know if it just didn't like me today or like if it was just like wet or thick or hot or something. I don't know what was going on, but it was... Uh Yes, I'm in my bathrobe and um, I do have my towel on. I just got out the shower. I just woke up about, so I've been up for about four hours and I'm just now getting my day started. So that's okay. We're going to move past it. Um, I've already put on my correcting concealer. Um, this is something new that I've been trying. So I'm really interested to see how it's going to turn out. Um, and yes, I'm going to be using this new BB Marble Eyeshadow Palette. So hopefully you guys are interested in seeing this. Yep, but I've already done my intro, so let's get to it. Um, so what I did to prep my face basically was I used my tea tree oil and coated it after I finished washing my face. And I used some, um... What is it? Oh, and then I use my firming cream, Luxology firming cream, and it is the 24K rose gold one. Yes, it does miracles. Just rub it in right here in the areas you feel like you want tightened up. I should probably be sponsored by them because I'm looking pretty bomb right now. And then I just use my Physicians Formula 24 Karat Gold Collagen Serum, and it just really just clumps the crap out of your skin so like if you pinch it it's just gonna snap back just snappity snap so that's what this is for and then oh and then obviously i'm going in with my dr jart water drop which is kind of like a hydrator but it's the hydration that makes you not sweat so it's like your skin is going to stay hydrated throughout the day under your makeup but it'll also help you from like respiring i have not outlined my eyebrows which i need to do right now and then i'm gonna start with my foundation and i'm gonna blend it out i tried this color corrector for the first time doing my foundation and i did okay. fix my cameras off uh, i mean i did fix my eyebrows fix my camera i fixed my cameras off i i mean I fixed <laughs> my eyebrows off camera because my camera was messing up so I had to fix my camera as well. Shut your bubblegum dumb dumb looking ass the fuck. But now I'm about to go in with some concealer and we gonna continue on with the video. You know what I'm saying? So now I'm about to go in with my medium beige LA, uh, LA Girl Concealer and just apply that under my eye area right here. Not too much. Because I already have foundation on under my eyes too. <clears throat> just put a little bit right there. Because I have a scar right there. And just this little line. With this. And kind of like a V. To give my chin some structure. And you know. Just. Here. And here. I think I'm gonna go with chestnut. Yeah, cause chestnut is a little bit more brown and the other one I have, which is espresso, is like a really like a darker, deep, deep, deep tone. So let's see what this one do today. And here. I almost forgot where I was supposed to put my contour. I'm going to take my mini brush and just blend my mini brush. My mini sponge beauty blender. 
and I'm just going to blend that out into my eyebrow. I don't know why I felt like blending my contour out first, but I guess I just did, so I did it. Because I usually would do my concealer. But I guess I'm feeling the contour more than I am the concealer today. That's okay. I just want to put my weight on you. I don't even know why that. <clears throat> so now I'm about to go in with my City Color Collection Banana Powder and just apply that under my eyes. Yeah, I currently have this everywhere. So let me just get this off of me and off of my beautiful white robe because. Uh, and while I wait for that to bake, I'm going in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Palette. And I'm going to be using the Collade. Um, I don't know what color it is. <laughs> Um, I'm going to be going in with this darker color right here and just applying it to my contour lines. <laughs> and I'm going to take a smaller brush and contour my nose. Duh. And now we're about to open this eyeshadow. Duh. So this is the BB Metallic Eyeshadow Palette. And I got it for 11 bucks. So that's not bad. Um, and it looks really pretty. This is the packaging. I just took it out of this pretty metallic box. And it's in the plastic. And I just, you know, take it out. So... There are three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fourteen. There are fifteen shades in here, and each of them have like this weird, like but also pretty kind of like rock look in them, where it looks like um, like I don't know how to explain it. Rip it, rip it, and ain't never hurt nobody. So yeah, these are the colors and like there's this, oh, sorry, right. that was the brush. Um, but they have like these weird looking like blotches in them almost where it's kind of like, I don't know. Like I don't know how to explain it without sounding crazy. But first I'm going to be going in with my Beauty Treats <laughs> Daydreamer Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm going to be using some transition shades and then we are going to go in with a BB eyeshadow metallic palette. All these words, geez, I'm just getting so tongue twisted. So we're going to go in with this kind of burnt orange right here and just apply that to the outer sides of our eye.
this is such a pretty color yes pretty color pretty pretty color pretty color and now I'm going to be going in with where are you where are you Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this is my nyx eyeshadow base and i'm going to just be putting that at the bottom of my lid Yep, 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 there you go, there you go, there you go. I'm gonna kind of clean it up. I'm gonna go back in with my red shade and blend on top of that so I don't get confused with what lines I'm supposed to be following. And just kind of blend everything together. I don't know how pigmented these are. So I got to be prepared for whatever. And now I'm going to be using the brush that came with the palette in the palette. The little sponges. And I'm going to be going in with this pink and yellow color right here. And just. Yeah. And just applying that onto my lid. Oh. 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 Time to turn the brightness down. Y'all have to see this. This is so pretty. It's it's almost like, okay, so because the colors have like these mixtures in them, once you mix it, it starts mixing the colors together like that shiny silver that was inside the yellow and the pink. And it just makes it like, oh, oh. I ain't, I wasn't expecting this. I wasn't, I wasn't. Ooh, let's see what water does to it. All right, let's see what some water does. Let's see let's see okay it's kind of clumpy almost but not like bad just like if I didn't have setting powder on it would probably be bad Yeah, so the water just makes it look even more pretty. I have no complaints so far. Like, I think this is a really, really, really pretty eyeshadow color. It's a really pretty palette. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and finish my makeup real quick. Well, I'm going to finish my eyeshadow look. Now that I know what the metallic looks like, and I'm just going to let you guys watch.
well i got my eyeliner kind of fixed even though it looks lopsided this one looks perfect and this one looks like it's just about to go fly away i'm trying my best <laughs> to do what i can and fix this but it's just not working out for me and i'm about to start getting angry and i don't want to get angry so i'm trying to fix everything that i need to fix so i can do my eyelashes and my lipstick and my highlight okay so let me fix this real quick and i'll be right back Ugh. okay finally i have freaking finished my eyeliner and stuff Ugh. it took forever and almost a year to do it but that's okay we gonna keep it moving so now I'm about to apply my highlight with this golden color right here by my Beauty Creations palette. This kind of almost looks like the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour palette, but we're not going to say nothing. We're not going to talk about it. We're just going to keep it moving and mind our business. Bomb highlights. Um, highlights or no and we gotta clean this up because obviously this highlight is a little too much okay bam the sephora micro smoothing powder and y'all already know what i'm about to do just go over everything on my face with this And we gonna put some eyelashes on. I'm gonna be using, I was about to turn my camera off too. Dang, what happened to my eyelashes that fast? Oh yeah, I'm going to be using the Iconic brand again and I'm going to be using these lashes right here. And we'll be back, okay? We'll be back, we'll be back, okay? The lipstick that I use right now is Lolita and that is by Kat Von D. Um, I usually use this as my go-to lipstick whenever I don't know what other color to use because this is a good color that goes with almost anything. Um, and I just, you know, fixed my eyeliner because I was struggling. Um, I put on my eyelashes. I showed you guys those were from the Iconic, uh, lash brand. And you guys saw my highlight was from Scandalous Glow Palette, which looks like the Anastasia Beverly Hills Palette, but we're not gonna say nothing about that we gonna keep that <sighs> wrapped up in a box over there and we're gonna put it away so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video it took a lot of time for me to do this i started this video at 12 something and then i showed you guys when it was like one something it is now 402 and it's storming outside and it looks really really bad so i'm about ready to just go eat and take a nap so yeah until next time, my loves, I hope you guys enjoyed this look.